What are you doing here? Hippocrates sent me. Your commander stole his notes. And I think you have them. The ones written by the great Hippocrates himself. I'm sorry. They were burned in the last attack. What? You heard me. The medical tent was burned. At least I memorized the notes before we lost them. I'll transcribe them when I have time, or when the war subsides. Then, you'll have to come with me. A patient Hippocrates is treating will die without your help. I have a patient right here who needs my help. Can't someone else take care of this one? I'm the only doctor here. Now let me work. There isn't enough time. I need you at Hippocrates' camp. Now. <clears throat> Patient, Hippocrates. I couldn't remember the proper steps for treatment and you were gone so long. Where am I? What's going on? My friend here, Alexios, brought you to help me with a patient, Dimas. I went to see the priests first. I had to find out about my mother. A worthy pursuit, though it cost this man his life. The payment we should seek is the preservation of life. A good doctor puts the needs of his patients first. I have learned a lesson today. I will take some time and write down what I remember of your nose, Hippocrates. Hippocrates, I'm sorry the patient died. But I still need to know what happened to my mother. 
Come with me. We should talk. The importance of diet to maintaining one's health cannot be overstated. What good can one apple really do? <laughs> well, taken daily, they can keep the doctor away. But to more serious matters, I know why you're here. You're looking for your mother. You remember her? I was young then. I didn't know how to help. I turned her away. But her look of determination and despair was born into my mind. It has never left me, and it never will. After, I swore to Apollo that I wouldn't turn away another patient, that I'd dedicate my life to the cause. She made an impression on me. Your brave mother did. She would be happy to know that. I know something that may help you find her. I swore I would never tell anyone about Dolops and his past, but I owe this to your mother. Who's Dolops? He was a priest who dedicated his life to helping orphans. It's possible he remembers that night long ago. Maybe he would know something about your mother and her child. I'll go see this man. Thank you, Hippocrates. Thank <laughs> you.